Right now, detectives are investigating the death of a wrestler and father. He was shot outside his home in Justice earlier this week, reportedly while trying to protect his daughter. Elizabeth Matthews is live with the latest on the search for the killer. Elizabeth? Yeah, still no one in custody on the shooting that happened in Justice late Monday night, uh, just before midnight in Justice Monday night. You're right. Family tells us that this father of four was trying to protect one of his one of his daughters. He has three daughters and one son at the time of the shooting. The family now tells me they are stunned to learn of his passing and are still trying to digest what took place in the suburbs here on Monday night. Richard Rubalcava, who goes by Tony, was 42 years old, was a prominent Chicago wrestler, went by the name Super Bad Santana Starks, and had been wrestling since he was about 20 years old. He and his cousin even starting a pro wrestling federation in Chicago. Monday night, he was in his home in Justice when one of his kids called for him to come outside. The victim's mom tells me there was a group of young adults there. He yelled at his daughter to run back inside, and he was shot twice. He was saving it by his house for his, him and his kids. He, he was at the happiest he's ever been. He was. And he died protecting his daughter. Justice police tell us that their officers tried to save him on scene, tried to revive him, but Tony died about 20 minutes later at a nearby hospital. He leaves behind three grown daughters and a young son. There's no one in custody, but Justice Police say this was an isolated incident. Reporting live from the suburbs, Elizabeth Matthews, Fox 32, Chicago.